Before we move on to step two, I want to talk about routers and firmware. And a lot of people want to know if their router is compatible and if so, what version of firmware to download. Now, I'll discuss that. Let's go over to the Wi-Fi router link. And here's a page that um, tells you a lot of information about routers and the firmware. Um, briefly, firmware is your router's operating system. And you can upgrade this operating system and increase your router's functionality. And that's basically what we're doing. And we, we have to do this to, to be able to um, use DotSpot with your router. So what we're going to do is we're going to see if your router is compatible. And here's a link to a chart of supported routers that will tell you that. Before we do this, I want to make note of this sentence in red. It's very important that your router must have 4 megabytes of flash memory to install this firmware. Now remember that it's very important. Um, this information is not on the side of a box and it can easily get confused with regular memory. It's not. So please look at this, this chart carefully and let's find out if your router has enough memory. Okay, well here's the chart and it virtually has almost every model or make of routers that I know of. Now I'm going to go to Linksys because that's my router. And my version is the WRT54GL. This is my router. Here's the version. This is a link to um, the manufacturer's website. This is the version. You're going to need to know this when you download um, the firmware. You need to know what version it is. And it'll tell you that in the bottom of the router. Next is the um, hardware type. You also need to know this um, when you're in the download area. Um, next is the um, version of DDWRT. This says it can handle any version. Micro doesn't have the technology we need. We need something called Chili Spot. I'll discuss that in a second. And we need four megabytes of flash memory. And this is the flash memory section. Right next to it is the regular memory. As you can see, it's different. And you need four megabytes for it to work. The router above only has two. That one's not going to work. The one below has eight. Now with eight megabytes, you can um, you can install the mega version of DDWRT, which has even more enhanced functionality. I'll go over that later too. Anyhow, over here is the directions, and it'll tell you what version that you need for this particular model. In my case, it's it's a two parties flash and you start with the mini version and then you upgrade to um, well in my case standard because I only have four megabytes of flash memory you can upgrade to mega if you had eight anyhow so that's it I'm gonna head over to the download area and grab my uh, my mini and my standard firmware downloads so let's go back go back over here and before we do this I want to show you the different versions and features of DDWRT I'm going to scroll down and it's this is a comparison chart of everything that is compiled in this software and what we're looking for is chili spot this is the technology that works directly with dot spot your version must have this. And you can see that the NoCade, the standard, and the Mega version has this. So this is up to you which, which version you want. It's entirely up to you, but just keep that in mind. 
you definitely need chili spot. So let's go to the download um, site. And here is a link to download DDWRT. We need version 24. At least I do for my router. Your router might be different. So we go to version 24. Um, the hardware type was Broadcom, if you remember. And Linksys. And I am the WRT50LG1.1. 54GL. That's my router. Okay, and I'm looking for the mini version because it's a two part flash. I'm going to download that. And then the second part of the upgrade, I have to upgrade to the standard. And here it is right here. As you can see, the standard version has 3.6 megabytes. This is why you need 4 megabytes of flash memory. So here we go, I'll download that too. Okay, that's it.